I was journaling this morning and I had the thought, I remembered rather, when I wrote those two words on my vision board, I wrote complete healing. And when I wrote complete healing, I was thinking about complete healing in my body. I was looking at and hoping for being able to have a normal month and not bleeding three weeks at a time. That's what I was seeing as complete healing. I was seeing as restoration of the way things used to be. But there is a portion of scripture that says God will do exceedingly and abundantly above anything that you can ask, think, or imagine. So when I wrote complete healing, thinking that was complete healing of my body, God showed me how he could also heal my mind He could also heal my outlook. He could also heal my expectations. And that's what helped me to dream again. Understand that when we set goals, it's not just about checking stuff off a list. It's not just about achievements. God created us for purpose and part of that purpose is fulfilling the things that he put us here to do. Part of that purpose is even our fulfillment. He wants us to be happy. He wants us to feel complete. He wants us to feel a sense of accomplishment. There are verses in the Bible that talk about keeping your eye on the prize and working toward the mark of the high calling in Christ. It's not just about achievements. It's not just about accomplishments. It's about healing and wholeness. And you absolutely cannot expect to achieve the goals that you want to achieve in life without healing and without wholeness. A lot of us are trying to move on from a person or a place or a situation without healing. And that's what keeps us in the cycle. And after one accomplishment, after one new achievement, we find ourselves backed up in a corner, trying to scale a wall, trying to climb a mountain one more time. And we're thinking, why do I keep hitting this this wall? Why do I keep facing this issue over and over again? And sometimes we think it's the same issue, but it's not the same issue is just a different level of the thing that we haven't healed from. So no matter what your goals are for this year, for your life, make healing one of them. Position yourself, position your heart, position your mind, position your life, not just for achievement, but for healing. Your vision will become so much clearer when you give yourself the time, the space, and the opportunity to heal. Blessings on your journey.